We're an organization that is fighting to have more women represented in the media because our, our understanding of life events, war, peace, healthcare, whatever, is different than men's. We experience it different, we understand it differently, and if you don't have our narrative equally represented in the media, then women and men are robbed of half the story. Like all movements, you can't just pass a law, you can't just have one march, it must be enduring and sustainable. So we're looking for institutional change with companies, with individuals, it takes more than one person. It will take all of us working together, men and enlightened, excuse me, women and enlightened men. Shortly after President Trump became president and assumed the office, I think uh, 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 one of his favorite targets has been the news media, you know, and saying, that there's fake news when it doesn't fit, it doesn't please him or doesn't fit his agenda. It is a dangerous time, and yes, for those of us who are threatened, well, many of us are accustomed to being threatened. You know, I'm accustomed to being threatened to be killed all the time. And so- How does I'm, that affect you? Well, I'm careful, but I'm not intimidated by it at all. I'm careful and I don't do foolish things and I have security uh, where I need to have security and I keep doing what I do.